Talk show host Bill Maher said President Donald Trump would have praised dictators like Benito Mussolini and Adolf Hitler as strong leaders during his HBO show on Friday. During a discussion with panelists, Maher slammed the way Trump acted after the FBI raided his personal lawyer's office and said that the only way Trump would make it through the presidency if the U.S becomes a fascist dictatorship, we've read the list of the many ways in which he is a banana republic dictator. The family, who has key jobs, you know, the missile parade, the list goes on. But when a leader says, an attack against me is an attack against our country, there's nothing more fascist than that, said Marr during his show, Real Time with Bill Marr, the HBO host then asks what he thinks Trump would have thought of dictators like Hitler or Mussolini during their rise to power in Europe, if Donald Trump was president in 1938, what do you think he would be saying about Hitler and Mussolini? Strong leaders, strong leaders. Very strong. He would love them, said Marr. Host Bill Marr speaks on stage at the Cinema for Peace event benefiting J.P. Haitian Relief Organization in Los Angeles held at Montage Hotel on January 14, 2012 in Los Angeles, California. Marr said during his talk show, Real Time with Bill Marr, that President Donald Trump would praise dictators like Adolf Hitler and Benito Mussolini as strong leaders. Getty Images Marr also poked fun at Trump about adult film actress Stormy Daniels during his opening monologue right after the missile attacks in Syria. See all of the best photos of the week in these slideshows. It looked like Trump was backing off his threat to attack Syria, but apparently he got the go-ahead from Fox. The late-night talk show host's comments come right after Trump called the FBI raid on his attorney's office and hotel room a disgrace and an attack on our country. This is not the first time Trump has faced criticism for hailing leaders of different countries. Trump has previously praised leaders like Chinese President Xi Jinping and Russian President Vladimir Putin. In March, he praised Jinping for announcing that he would serve as president for life.